Good day to everybody. It's the Piano Rescuers here. Today we're working on the action of this grand piano. Now, you can see something quite noticeable if we have a look here. You can see some older looking hammers and then some nice newer looking hammers. Well, they're actually the same hammer, um, same hammer head. The only thing we've done is, so let's say you play the piano over the 20, 30, 40 years, it gets little grooves in it, as you can see. Those grooves are from the hammers hitting the strings under high force. So as you can imagine, the string being up there and the hammer striking it, eventually it gets these grooves in the tops of the hammer. Now, it's a, it's a saying that, you know, anything from one to two to three millimeters is fine on a hammer. The deeper the grooves, you will get a more muffled sound and not as nice of a crisp sound. Okay, so what we've done on these hammers here, you see how they're nice and rounded? And these ones here have slightly smaller grooves, but these ones here have much larger grooves. It's actually called uh, hammer teasing. What we do is we carefully remove each hammer. And what we do to the felt is we tease it. So we pretty much use a special device and we loosen up this felt head to make it softer again. Now, these are very hard and we make these much softer. And by doing that, it gives the hammer head a nice rounded shape and it allows to strike the string at the very tip of the hammer. So no longer on a flat surface like that, muffling the strings. Uh, so that's pretty much just a quick uh, overview uh, on how to improve the sound of your piano as well. This is quite a you know, lengthy and, and time consuming process, but it's not expensive and it definitely adds a lot of tone to your piano and uh, you can enjoy the instrument for another 20, 30 years before it'll need another service like this, or maybe even 50 to 60, like this one here. All right, have a lovely day, guys, and stay in touch. We're the Piano Rescuers from Canberra.